Datsuts and welcome to Dats Review Channel and a special hello to new visitors. Um, I hope you click the subscribe button and become a regular viewer. And as usual there's an index in the description for the video so you can move to any part of the video. In this review I'm reviewing the Unicorn Global Adam Hunt darts. Uh, these are 90% tungsten and 23 gram. Uh, there's only the one model in the range because it's the Unicorn Global range. And these retail for £27.95, so let's check them out. The darts come in a, a plastic clamshell case, and inside you've got a hard plastic compact case. And the darts are fitted with um, some gripper stems, medium size. Let's get them out. Uh, very nice looking dart. Um, you've got your little weight guarantee there. Let's see what it says. Uh, 23.1 grams. And the Unicorn Adam Hunt standard shape flights and some flight protectors. The darts are fit with a silver point. And as you can see, it's kind of a, a priestly teardrop kind of shape barrel. Got a very nice uh, ring grip on the, the nose. And then it kind of has a chunky ring grip with thin grooves. And as you get onto the straight part of the barrel, got some thin rings and grooves. And then a smooth section on the end of the barrel. Um, as a front gripper, I could be gripping that chunky part, but it actually feels very comfortable there. And I suspect um, people who are around middle and rear grip will probably find that comfortable. But I'd say overall, the grip is a little bit of a mixture between... Um, medium and high medium but, uh, it does have a very nice shape to the barrel and your unicorn gripper stems and the Adam Hunt global signature flights The darts are fitted with a silver 29mm point. It's got a thin ring grip on the nose of the barrel which is 8.8mm wide. Then you've got this chunky ring grip with the thin grooves in between which are painted black and white. That's 16.8mm wide. And then as you get into the straight section you've got some more ring grip which is 9.5mm wide and then a smooth section of 13.3mm the length is 48.3mm and the width is 7.45mm twenty-three 23.24 grams 23.25 grams and 23.26 23.25 grams and the full setup as supplied is 24.81 grams due to the shape it's a little awkward to balance but with nothing attached it's just front of center and with the supplied setup it's slightly behind this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights Certainly has a chunky feel at the front. Um, I was expecting that really because it is a little bit bulbous shape back there. Yes, super chin strikes again. 
Looks like I'm just going for the small 20s at the moment. No, I missed completely. seem too bad through the air though. It's getting a little bit of spin at time with the front grip but um, I don't know maybe it's a little bit too chunky for some but I don't mind that. So I'm going to try the middle section now and it obviously goes a little bit slimmer there and it actually feels a little bit more comfortable as well but we'll see, see how it feels when I throw it. Sideways, that's better. They're very smooth from there, and I don't think I notice much spin, if any. So that certainly feels more comfortable to grip. And through the air, it's very nicely weighted. There's a nice arc from there. I think it's because of the front weighted style. if you like that front weighted shape and even feels more comfortable there and you've also got a little bit of ring grip there so Oop. I think I kept my finger on too long there that's the only thing it just feels that little bit more awkward for me as a natural front gripper most of the time it's because I, I still like to grip right on the point as I do with my front grip, but it, because it's extending my fingers a little bit further, it often feels more awkward. Yeah, I can get the hell of it from the rear. It's not as good from the rear as it was from the middle for me. So, there you go, the Unicorn Adam Hunt darts. Um, as a front gripper, it's not bad and it has like a chunky feel, like I said. So, if you don't mind a chunky style of barrel, then it could be worth trying for a front gripper. But I definitely think it was best around the middle. Um, the weight and balance just feels just right and it feels more comfortable to hold there than it is at the front. And towards the rear, it's still quite comfortable, but um, it was a bit hopeless for me. I just couldn't get the hang of it from there. And it could be for a number of reasons, mainly because it's obviously not my natural grip, but I was even further away from the balance point there, so around the middle, I felt just right, and it, and it kind of had a nicer arc at the middle, so I would say definitely try it for middle grippers but if you're a rear gripper it's probably still worth a try but it just depends on where you're gripping it and whether you like a front weighted barrel but um, when it was flying um, from the middle it was mostly very smooth so it seemed like a very nice dart from there 
So I would definitely try it for middle grippers and possibly worth a look if you like front weighted barrels for a rear gripper. As a front gripper it all depends because I don't find it as comfortable to hold there but the chunky feel doesn't really bother me but I think it people that are gripping around there are going to get the best out of it more so than a front gripper even though it's front weighted. So that's the end of the review, thanks for watching.